Hi there, everyone. This is Jenna from Savantis. So some of you may have noticed that recent versions of Office now offer you the ability to auto-save your documents so long as they are stored in either SharePoint or OneDrive. In fact, auto-save is actually turned on by default for any documents stored online, and that means that if you have a document that's saved on OneDrive or SharePoint and you make some changes, those changes are automatically going to sync back up to the cloud. This is really great in situations where you might be working on a long document or you know you're going to be interrupted pretty frequently and you want to make sure that if you get distracted and something happens with your PC that you're not going to lose any of your changes. But what about those times where you just do not want your documents to autosave? For example, let's say that you've got a library in SharePoint and your entire team uses it for things like templates, templates for projects, for contracts, what have you and you don't want to run the risk of having somebody go in there thinking that they are modifying a contract for a specific client and they accidentally autosave all of their changes and now your entire team is stuck with this uh, untemplated template basically. Uh, you don't want to have to go back and roll back all of those changes. It's just kind of a pain. So what we're going to do is we're going to quickly go over the two options that you have for turning off that autosave function. We've got step-by-step -step instructions on our blog for how to do this as well. So if you're just not into watching an entire video, that's fine. I have linked to that in the description below. All right, are you ready? So first of all, let's talk about turning off autosave for a single document. Good news, this is super easy. You're just going to open the document, look in the upper left-hand corner of the screen, and switch that little autosave toggle from on to off. That's it. Just remember that you're going to need to manually save this document going forward. All right, now what if you absolutely despise the autosave function and you want to turn it off forever? Good news, you can do that, but you're going to need to remember that you have to do it in each one of the different Office applications. That means you'll have to do it in Word, you'll have to do it in Excel, PowerPoint, Publisher, whichever document, whichever programs it is that you're going to want to turn that off for. More good news, that should only take you about three minutes, so it's not a big deal. I'm going to show you how to do this with Word to begin with, and then you're just going to go back and repeat those steps for Excel and PowerPoint and whichever other apps you might be using this setting for. Okay, so let's start by pulling up Word. In the lower left, we're going to click on Options. Next, let's click on Save, and that Save menu from the left navigation here. And finally, just uncheck the box that says Auto Save OneDrive and SharePoint Online Files by default on Word. Click OK, and that's it. You're all set. I hope you found this helpful. For more tips on Office 365, Dynamics GP, or any of the Dynamics 365 products from Microsoft, subscribe to our channel here and check out our blog in the description. Thanks, and we'll see you next time.